Chapter 1 Internal Organs and Their Functions Learning Objective Our Organs Muscular System Nervous System Digestive System Excretory System Circulatory System Reproductive System Breathing System Let me answer How many bonds are present in our body? Our organs Human body is a combination of different systems that work systematically together. The human body is made up of a large number of small units known as cells. Cells of the same kind join together to form a tissue. Tissues join together to make an organ. Our body has two types of organs, external organs and internal organs. The organs which are on the outer side of our body are called external organs. The organs which are inside our body are called internal organs. We cannot see them from outside. Internal organs are packed inside our body. They perform like a group and show different functions. Group of internal organs that perform certain functions is called organ system. In bits, no part in human body is useless or unnecessary. Each and every part has its use. Different systems of body Skeletal system Lungs Heart Liver Stomach Brain Lungs heart Teachers note Inform the students about different internal organs and their functions in the human body. The skeletal system is the framework of our bones. A human body has 206 bones. The bones are hard and strong. They give shape and support to the body. Muscular system There are more than 600 muscles in our body. Muscles along with bones help the body to move. Nervous system It receives messages from the sense organs and other parts of the body and orders for action. Various actions like seeing, hearing, learning, thinking, speaking are also controlled by the brain, which is a part of this system. Brain controls all other systems in our body. Digestive system the breaking down of food from complex to simple soluble form is called digestion. Mouth, stomach, small intestine and large intestine take part in digestion. What is digestion? How is food digested? You digest food means you change it into the simplest form that can be absorbed by the blood. What happens inside the mouth? When you bite a sandwich, you find that it becomes very wet in your mouth. The saliva begins to flow into your mouth and your sharp biting teeth in the front cut it and your flat grinding teeth at the back grind the food. If you chew bread for some time, you will find it turning sweet. This is because the digestive juice, saliva along with an enzyme, a substance which helps in digestion, changes the starch in bread into sugar. Hence, it tastes sweet. What happens to the food inside the stomach and the intestine? Stomach From the mouth, the food goes into the stomach. Here, the food is churned and mixed with several digestive juices produced by the walls of the stomach. Germs are killed by an acid which also helps to break the food down into simple substances. The stomach takes about 4 hours to digest the food. The food then goes to the lower part of the stomach and from there into the small intestine. Excretory system The wastes in the body have to be removed regularly. This work is done by the organs of the excretory system. The kidneys, lungs and skin help to throw out waste materials from the body in the form of urine, breath out air, carbon dioxide and sweat. Circulatory system The blood supplies food, oxygen and other materials to all parts of the body and takes back waste materials. 
This work is done by the process of circulatory system. In this system, heart is the main organ. It pumps the blood to different parts of the body. Reproductive system The organs of this system help to produce babies. Because of this system, life on the earth goes on. Breathing system Nose, windpipe and lungs make breathing system. This system supplies oxygen to the various parts of our body. This oxygen is used to burn food and give us energy to do work. Good breathing habits 1. Always breathe through your nose. 2. Breathe fresh air. 3. Keep the windows of the room open. 4. Do not cover your face while sleeping. 5. Wear loose clothes that make you feel comfortable. And for bits, skin is the largest sense organ in our body. Summary Human body is the most wonderful and perfect machine. The organs inside our body are grouped together to form different system. The skeletal system gives shape and support to the body. The nervous system receives messages and gives orders for actions. We must learn correct breathing habits. Exercise A. Take the correct option A. The smallest unit of human body is ear, cell, tissue. Answer Cell B. A human body has dash bones 206 208 207 Answer 206 C. There is a skull in our dash Head Leg Hand Answer Head D. Stomach is a part of dash system Digestive Nervous Skeletal Answer Digestive E. Dash is related to breathing system Food Walk Oxygen Answer Oxygen B. Fill in the blanks A. The breaking down of food from complex to simple soluble form is called dash Answer Digestion B. The dash, dash and dash Throw out waste materials in the form of urine, breath out air and sweat Answer Kidneys, lungs and skin C. Saliva is present in the dash. Answer. Mouth. D. The human body is made up of a large number of small units known as dash. Answer. Cells. C. Right, true or false. A. The brain receives messages from all parts of the body. Answer. True. B. The food we eat is in a simple form. Answer. False. C. We should always breathe through our mouth. Answer. False. D. The skeletal system is a framework of 206 bones. Answer. True. E. The human body works very much like a machine. Answer. True. D. Match the following. A. The breathing system. Answer. Helps in breathing. B. The skeletal system. Answer. Gives shape and support to our body. C. The digestive system. Answer. Helps in digestion of food. D. The circulatory system. Answer. Helps in circulating the blood. E. The excretory system. Answer. Helps in throwing wastes from the body. E. Answer the following questions. A. How does our body work? Answer. Our body receives messages and orders for action from the sense organs and other body parts. The brain controls all other systems in the body. B. Write the function of the breathing system. Answer. The breathing system supplies oxygen to the various parts of our body. This oxygen is used to burn food and give us the energy to do work. C. Write the functions of the circulatory system. Answer. 
in the circulatory system the heart is the main organ it pumps blood to different parts of the body d what is the function of the digestive system answer the breaking down of food into complex to simple soluble forms is called digestion the mouth stomach small intestine and large intestine takes part in digestion draw a picture of human ear <laughs> 